Well, confident that that was going to beat Roger Tuza, but off, big chase. Well, this could be tight, a good throw. Good judgment of the third run from Carlisle and a no ball to boot. Just, just past Nathan Astle who turns the chase in vain. But that was uh, a little ray of sunshine almost for Chris Martin. If that had a... That's another chase for Roger Tews, but that's just a, a token gesture, beautifully timed. And now Chris Martin has another problem, and so does his captain. 84 for two after just 13 overs. He concedes four, dropped it short. And that has uh, cost his sight. Another boundary, 92 for two Zimbabwe after the 15 overs, picking him off. In drifting into leg stump, Chris Harris. Just erring with his line early on here. Three runs will result. Straight back. And what a blow from Stuart Carlisle. Nice, Piggy. And that's a very well compiled 50 for Stuart Carlisle. Associated with Andy Flower in this huge partnership, and hasn't he batted well? Down the leg side, and that's uh, away, and just bounced inside the line, I think. Yes, it did. Loose delivery from Styrus. Carlisle's been there long enough to cash in. Over the top, and uh, nobody home down there, and just inside the line I think big blow by Stuart Carlisle and they go to check it here we go and there's another boundary this is a very very good cricket shot this isn't a slog by any means Straight to the captain at mid off, skimming catch of McMillan. Wanted to get a little bit more loft on that, perhaps wanting to get it to extra cover a little bit more. However, picked the captain out, he's gone for 76, and Zimbabwe now 211 for four.